This short video will show you how to use the Physical Characteristics Wizard in Sitka's Evergreen. The Physical Characteristics Wizard leads catalogers step-by-step -step through the Mark 007 field positions. The wizard displays the significance of the current position and provides drop-down lists of possible values for the various components of the Mark 007 field in a user-friendly way. This record is displaying an incorrect format icon. It shows video instead of DVD. To fix this, we will need to add or edit the 007 field. Click on Mark Edit. This record does not have a 007 field, so we will right click and select Add 007. Now we can click on this blue link button to open the physical characteristics wizard. If your record already had a 007 tag, you can click the blue link to edit your existing 007. The physical characteristics wizard will open. As you navigate through the wizard, each position will display its corresponding label that describes the significance of that position. Each position contains a selection of drop-down choices that list the possible values. When you make a selection from the drop-down options, the value for that position will also change. The first value defines the category of material. Select the category of material for the given record by choosing an option from the drop-down menu. The choices within the main remaining character positions will be appropriate for the category of material selected. We'll choose video recording. And then click on next. Evergreen will display each position that represents a potential value for the selected category of material and will skip obsolete values. By clicking either previous or next buttons, you may go forward and backward as needed through the various positions in the 007 field. As a visual reference, the position that the wizard is displaying will appear in bold red font. That way, users know which position they are working on at any given point within the wizard. For SMD, we'll choose video disc and hit next. Color, we will choose multicolored and hit next. Video recording format will be important for your format icon. I'm going to choose DVD and then next and sound on medium and next video disc and next other When you e reach the end, the next button will be grayed out. Remember, you can go back and use the previous button to change or edit any of the fields that you chose prior. When you're done, click on Save. All of the selected values will be displayed within the 007 field in the bibliographic record. You can click on Save Record and then go back to the OPAC view and click refresh and now you'll have the correct format icon for DVD. Thank you for watching this video and for more information please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.